long day. I don't know if you can tell from my fucking voice. We just swallowed gravel and rocks. At least two Batmen. I, uh, had a little cold. So my voice might be a bit gravelly, a bit stuffier. So, and they also lean away from like to blow my nose once in a while, so. We're gonna have a grand old time. We're gonna be able to really, like, hop. It's gonna be a grand old time. Ah, uh, we're back in the opera zone. Yeah, was five remastered. We are going to be playing Tatsu Shinada's story. Um, we're done with baseball. We got all our upgrades, we got a bunch of levels, we wrapped up the side story. And we're in the plot. And I honestly can't think of any better time to get started than right now. I recall correctly, about two streams ago, uh, yeah, Milky was said she'd be waiting for me on a roof up to Momo. She has been waiting for a while. We, don't, we went and did an entire side quest while she was waiting for us. But honestly, you know, it's like props to her. It's, that's some patience. Hopefully there's still cake left. Um, but let's, let's find out. And is on the sensor bar. Just in case. Nothing that doesn't happen to anyone, actually. ミルクちゃん、忘れちゃいたい過去ってある。そりゃこんな仕事しとるとね、覚え取りたいことの方が少ないがね。そっか。時々ね。自分のことを誰も知らん町に行って別の自分になってやり直したいって思う時あるわ。俺もそう思ってこの町で生きるようになってもう15年。懐かしいがね。たっちゃんが初めてこのお店に来た日。あの日は寂しくてしょうがなか
Yeah, let's just go home. And, uh... Ooh. That one was... That one stung. Nope, oh, phone call. Guess we're not going home just yet. Oh, voicemail. It's the office. Good evening. You know this month's Nightlife magazine letter being right on time. Nice going. Won't stop talking about your feature. I bet her club appreciates it too. Hope to see more like it next time. Oh, and this is completely unrelated, but I should tell you anyway. We received some gifts from one of our affiliates. Get over tonight. We'll be gone by tomorrow, so if you'd like some, I suggest you swing by before we close up shop. Right. Have something for me? You might as well stop by. That is awfully nice of them. To leave something for us. Uh, and I believe what is left for us is actually determined by how we answered in the questions regarding our handwriting earlier in uh, chapter one. I'm actually not sure. Um, I'm pretty sure I got them all right last time. I got a stamina royale. Uh, and I don't think I got any wrong this time. So, you know, answer those clarifications correctly and... And nab yourself a nice healing item. Unless I didn't get it right. Oh, no, nope, Stamina Royale. Up in your face, did you get into a fight? Yeah, kinda, sorta. Like you headbutted a beehive. But that stings. Well, I should get going. Stay out of trouble now. Got what I came for. Now to call it a night. Let's do that. Okay. It's no more conversation. I would just like to go home and go to bed. Oh. Oh, right, this guy. Dude, what is up with your freaking claws? <laughs> Those eyebrows! The ghost of an old lady! For real, this clown probably got lost on his way to the circus. Ha <laughs> ha! Violence, peasant. I have a mind to banish you ignorant buffoons on the spot. Be gone, you blustering assholes. What? You just talking back at us? Oh, I'm steamed, man. Ooh, you steamed him good. Steamed him like a steam clam. You shouldn't have done that, dude. Now he's gonna make you pay. That's supposed to be a shakedown? What's this world coming to? You gotta admit, the guy does look weird, though. He does look weird, and yet we must come to his aid all the same, because this man is actually really important. But first, I guess this guy wants to talk. Okay. Well... Pipe! Get the pipe, idiot! Don't grab me. Ah! Ah, my face! Get! Hey! I'm saying! Get! Pipe, idiot! Well. Thank God for that belt. Alright, we have a sword now. Who's this? Oh god. He's fine. He's okay. Don't worry about it. Oh. Looking at his combo. Shinada's control with a blade is clearly... Put that bone down! Impolite. Shouldn't be on your phone. Be with the people that are beating you up. Anyway, we got a silver plate. Let's help this guy. Huh? Hey, you see that shit again? Whatever the hell it was. I rightfully addressed you ignorant peasants as such. To us, it be a statement of fact. Okay, I've heard enough out of this ape and wearing lunatic. Mm -hmm. Let's kick his ass. What a pity. Besought by their living nature as commoners, two ruffians cross my path and bark their empty threats. Alas, I am forced to demonstrate my elegance that... Oh dear. Oh my. Did my pads drop it during my travels? What's the matter? Your elegance go running off somewhere? Probably the same place you left your fashion sense. Ah, uh, you see, I seem to have forgotten my armaments, which, uh, needless to say, are important. Oh, without your ass, scrim, my you can't just weasel away out of a confrontation after dunking on our intelligence. Now, now, I assure you, I am no grandma. I advise you to stay thy tongue. Lest you expose even more of your plebeian dimness of wit. Huh? You're still insulting us? That's it. You are definitely getting an ass kicking. Final decision. Oof. I don't want to get caught up in this mess. 
Methinks it's time to shuffle on out of here. Halt! Uh, halt, I say. Uh, d pardon, you there, impoverished looking fellow. Oh, me? Yes, you. Uh, look, uh, this is your chance to make a name for yourself. Make a name for myself? What are you talking about? Oh, for goodness sake, just come help me. Who the hell are you? You with this nut job? Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, keep me out of this. I'm just a peaceful, ordinary citizen who happened to walk by. See that? Says he's not interested. Oh, uh, he's just playing coy. Oh, uh, and in fact, he's my loyal minion. Hey, I'm not a minion. I'm not a minion. Eh, screw it. I don't give a crap either way. I'm kicking your ass first. Huh? Please tell me you're kidding. Nope. Gonna kick your ass. Oh, thanks for clarifying, man. Gonna kick your ass. Here it comes. Alright. Let's beat him up. And my beat him up. Look, just remember, you guys picked this fight. <laughs> Oh, that, I think that was the same. I think that's one of Majima's heat moves in his Mad Dog Silent Zero. Hey buddy, you gonna get up? You gonna get up? No, alright, well, he kinda did. And he went back down with a sword. Cutting me. Okay, well, I guess I'll address that later. We done. I really need to get going here. Screw you, dude, man. Dude, let's just go already. Okay, what about you, pal? My, my. Nicely done. I suppose that does merit a certain measure of praise. Praise? What happened to you jumping in and helping? I said you enjoyed a ringside view. And naturally, that sort of dirty menial labor is and should be relegated to the lower classes. Surely you don't expect the nobility to sully their pristine hands. The only thing remotely noble about you is your Heian era costume. You kind of comedian? I am nothing of the sort! And do address me with the proper honorifics, you writhing, squalid vermin. For I am the glorious, most venerable Leo Akaya Nakoji. Leo Aya Nakoji. It's written in the kanji for lion, to be sure, but it's pronounced Leo. I await you're interested. Let me get this straight. You really think you're a nobleman? And your name is what? Leo the Lion? <laughs> Dude, are you for real right now? Don't you dare laugh at me. I am a descendant of the gods. And I'll have you know my father is the chairman of the Neighborhood Association. I'd like to see you top that. Oh, man. <laughs> How oh, you keep a straight face this whole time? Have you even looked yourself in the mirror? Hm. Insolent and churlish. I am utterly appalled. For my depesement mocking one so great as I. Okay. Okay. Calm down. Listen, how old are you? I'll be 35 this revolution around the sun. You're 35 and this is what you do? Are you married? Wait, don't answer that. Of course you're not. If I were a lady, I'd run the other way at first sight. I simply haven't deigned to take a lover yet. When you bear the status that I do, women will throw themselves at your feet, so I can choose a wife whenever I wish. Ah, I get it. Something traumatized you a long time ago, and you completely lost your marbles. Why didn't I realize that sooner? Well, that's my cute exit. Bye now. Come now! Won't you hear me out? What is it you want? I'd really rather not be seen with you. Have you forgotten my royal lineage? We noblemen have a rich tradition of bestowing favors and feudal positions according to the exploits of our loyal foot soldiers. Huh? Wasn't that the samurai? I'm no history buff, but I can't really picture the nobility having done much of anything for the people. Cease this slander at once. Why must you lip off that way? I'm saying I will repay my debt, so shut up and accept my generosity, you insect. Ow. Oh, you're off the rails, man. Hmm. Given that early spectacle, you probably think of me as a coward, don't you? Yeah, yep, sure do. Well, there is far more to me than meets the untrained eye, for I am a weapons master, a living instrument of warfare. You can use weapons. Precisely. When it comes to instruments of war, I am proficient in any kind. It just so happened that I had none on my person. And how is this related to anything? I'm saying... I will accept you as my apprentice for weapons training. You should be on your hands and knees in gratitude. 
Aha. Don't look so nonplussed, you elfish bull. Listen here. I am usually around the TV tower, making my rounds. I will allow you to come and accept my teachings. Uh huh. Yes, yes, thank you for your questionable guidance. Maybe I'll show once I have the time. Then make the time, you bumbling baseball brute! Puh! You'll sing a different tune once you'll feast your wits on the wisdom I have to offer. Just be sure to appear at some point in the near future. Understood? Yeah, same, Shinara. What the heck was his deal? Anyway, he mentioned he'd be at the TV tower. You can always visit. We really have nothing better to do. And we don't have a lot worse to do because, yeah, Shinada gets two trainers. One for baseball and one for fighting. And Leo is going to be our combat trainer. So we should probably go hit him up. Just like all the other weapons. Just like all the other trainers, we should probably not delay in doing their training. First, there is a guy over here who's part of the Victory Road Tournament that I'd like to meet and address. That's this guy. Save. Hello. Hey, hey, you. Let's battle that out for Victory Road. Hey. Whoa, hold up. You're totally hammered. One of those drunken masters? Ah, that bad ex wrestler. Better watch your mouth. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, nice ex wrestler. Meet my sword. Ah, uh, no, you didn't meet it. I said, meet it. And also my boot. It's all over for me. <laughs> Can't even beat down a clown like this. What are you calling a clown? You should take a look at yourself first. Shut up. I may not seem like much now, but you're looking at the great Kenichi Washi, though. I have no idea who that is. They have never to. They called me a rising star back in my pro wrestling days. I had a bright future ahead of me. Then right after I made my debut, an opponent pulled an illegal move on me and put me in the hospital. That was the end of my career. Sounds like a familiar story. You telling me that's why you turned to the bottle? Of course it is. Can't make it through this life sober, that's for sure. But I'm done. <laughs> What's your fault? There's no going back. No second chances for losers in this world. I get the feeling you know what I'm talking about, huh? No point wasting time struggling. Join me and give up on life right now. I'm not like you. Eh! Just because you had a setback doesn't give you the right to get drunk and try and drag others down. Not everyone gives up that easily. Hey, you! I feel like you would have ended up like this even if you hadn't gotten injured. Ah! This is all the fun of the guy who broke the rules! There you go, placing the blame on others. You ever actually made an effort yourself and tried to change your life? It's your name anyway. Shinada. Hatsuo Shinada. I have about all the lip I can take from you, Shinada! I'm gonna show you just what happens when I play for keeps. You got it? You will just swipe. Uh oh. You look pretty serious at the end there. Oh man, this is gonna suck. Okay. Well, I guess we'll have to deal with him eventually. For now, I believe Ayata Koji is just up the way here. So let's go have a little chat with him and see about some training. Go on, move. Nope, oh, yeah, well, like a sore thumb. Hello. You. There you are, peasant. Am I not calling me that? The name's Tatsuo Shinada, just in case you're interested. Tatsuo Shinada. It is a peasant's name by my noble reckoning. Well, I have to admit, it's a pretty average compared to yours. Now that you present yourself to me can only mean one thing. You wish to take lessons from me. Well, yeah, I thought I'd check it out. Are your lessons really all that? <laughs> ah, 
<laughs> Hearken to me, Shinada. You cannot judge me based on what you have beheld. The skills I shall teach you are more precious than life itself. Of course, there is the matter of true service. I shan't lift a finger to those who do not serve me. Maybe you forgot, but I saved you from those street punks. And that is why I dined to take you as my student. And so the debt is paid. Seriously? The guy who talks about nobility, that seems awfully stingy. You served me once, and I shall repay you in kind. Once. I must keep things fair for my other vassals, after all. Okay, so what does the guy have to do to get some training around here? Anything's fine. I'm sure you could think of something just by your rattled peasant brain. Sheesh. Let's narrow it down a bit. Okay, let me think. Pretty broke, so anything to do with money is out of the question. Oh, I know. I know. Speak. Hey, could you be any more of an ass? Anyway, I've got some advice I can give you. Hmm. You advise me. <laughs> don't be ridiculous. I don't take advice from peasants. And besides, my considerable prosperity could hardly be bolstered by your input. So you say, but you want a girlfriend, don't you? No, I do not. Oh, come on, this is just between the two of us. You really want one, right? Well? Yes, and Mother's been pestering me about getting married, so perhaps... Hey, I knew it. Just relax and trust me and I'll set you up. Hmm. Somehow I feel as though you have tricked me into revealing this. You told me the truth, Leo Kun. That was the right thing to do. <coughs> not press your luck, you of lowly birth. It'll be very well. I shall act with yes. In my debate, you must make yourself useful in your faithful service to me. There will be no lesson until I'm utterly satisfied. Oh, you will be. Especially considering the bar is so low. What was that? You think to mock me? Of course not. Will you just relax already? Fine. I'll take you at your word. Hey! So, the deal is, you give me a lesson if you like the advice I give you. Very well. I'm counting on you, Shinoda. Do not disappoint me. Ah, oh, there you are. What do you want? Let's talk about your life. So these are the prerequisites to Akai Ayanokoji's training. You have to talk to him about his life. Okay, I'll give you some advice about your life. Must you be so immodest about it? Ugh, go on. Before I help you get a girlfriend, I need to know all about you. I'll ask you a few questions. All you have to do is answer. Very well, go on. Okay, let me ask you this. Have you ever had a girlfriend before? You already know the answer, but I suppose you want to hear me say it. No, I haven't. I see. Well, how about a one-night stand or something like that? An aristocrat such as I would never commit to such an abhorrent act. I wouldn't even hold hands with a damsel unless we were at least dating. Jeez, this guy's more naive than I thought. Okay, well, let me ask you this. Uh, what type of girl do you like? A girl suited to my aristocratic qualities. She must also be from a family of some standing. Finally, she must be equal parts intelligent and comely. Ever met a girl like that before? Or maybe I've been looking in the wrong places. Okay, one more question. What would you consider a relationship deal breaker? Speaking to any man other than me, naturally it would be utterly inexcusable. I had a pretty high bar to set. Ah, uh, such an ignorant peasant. You obviously don't understand the importance of protecting my noble lineage. This is worse than I thought. I don't know if any advice is going to help. I see. Alright, Leo Koo. From what you've told me, we're going to need to change the way you think. A lot. Ha! You think your impaired peasant mind could hope to change how I think? Don't make me laugh. Based on what I've heard so far, I should... I don't think he's going to be listening to any perspective. I doubt he cares about us enough to listen to a lecture, so... Let's go introduce him to some women. Alright, I know now that there's no way I'm going to persuade you with words alone. Mm. Finally, some wisdom. I commend you for knowing your place, but you aren't going to give up that easily, are you? That's not what I meant. Get ready, Leokun, because I'm going to show you how to be a man in more ways than one. What, what? What is this place? One of my favorite places. I reserved the most part of the girl for you. What's the meaning of this? I couldn't possibly enter such an establishment. Oh, uh, I should also mention there's some pretty scary types run on the joint, and they don't take kindly to sudden cancellations. Chinata! What have you done? Ayanokoji! 
Bounds! Oh, what are you doing? He's all tight. Why do I have to? Are you not Fine, fine, I'll go. Just stop shouting at me. All done. Oh, how was it? How shall I explain? Many things don't seem as important anymore. Nice. I'd call that a breakthrough. What's that supposed to mean? Bet it, you had a good time. Don't change the subject. You had a good time, right? Yes. Learned it's okay not to set the bar so high? Yes. And there it is. Nice job, Leo Kun. You're on the stairway to manhood. I am? Uh, I mean, I am, I suppose. Yes! Haha, <laughs> now you owe me. Ugh, fine. Yes, I owe you. Sweet! I'm gonna hold you to your word. Now, let's see. How much you buy me a TV? No, wait, how about a car? Then again, cash is always king. What? What are you babbling about? You said you wanted some training. Oh, yeah, right. I'm going to beat some good lessons into you, so you'd better prepare yourself. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. But okay, I'll be back when I'm ready. And we're ready right now. Let's go do that training. So, Iota Koji's training is lengthy. Uh, he's got one of the more difficult trainers. He's one of the more difficult trainers. Uh, I don't think he's as bad as the priest from the mountains for Saijima, but... Of course, that guy wasn't as tough because we were Saijima. And... Not many things are very difficult when you're Saijima. Uh, there's there's just a bit of a lengthy in-between doing Akai no Koji's, no Koji's trainings and his life advice. So it can feel like it goes on for a while. I don't think we're going to do all of these. Because they get pretty lengthy. <coughs> but we will. I'll, we'll do the first one now and then we'll do some plot. Ah, there you are. What do you want? Ah, uh, train me. Let's train. Very well, but we must change locales. Oh, what shall we do? What? Aren't you supposed to decide that? But I know nothing about you. How do you expect me to impart my science onto you? And for temper, Leo-kun. Fine, let us begin with a contest. I'm quite skilled with weapons, so I'll be out. If I bear handed all with a weapon, I'll allow you to do whatever you like. But don't expect reimbursement if you wear out a weapon battling me. Any repairs that might be required are coming out of your pocket. Yep. In actions are not available in training battles, make sure you're fully prepared, as Ayano Koji is far more dangerous than he looks. Alright, let's get thought. Are you fully prepared? Yes. So. As he claims... In each of Ayano Koji's trainings, he will be armed. For this first one, he has a baton. He also uses very similar attack strings to Shinada. Uh, one important thing, if you are fighting him barehanded, don't use your tackle, because he has a counter for it, and he will employ it. Uh, and just remember, heat actions aren't available, so bring some good weapons. He was also not lying when he said he won't reimburse weapons, so bring your sturdy ones if you're going to use them. Uh, for his baton, I would recommend using a faster weapon, so probably actually I should switch off the katana. So your sturdy iron pipe, or your knife. This is one of the reasons you should do all these side missions, because these sturdy weapons are super, super helpful for pretty much all of Shinada's story. Uh, in just about every context. Seems like the best option here would be their knife. Uh, just because he actually has... He will occasionally go under the, um... The proper hitbox for the, uh... 
iron pipe. Block. Attack. Aha. Oh yeah, and also he has two very substantial health bars, so, you know, you might want to bank up bringing some items and eat before you do it. Leia is probably not the most difficult of the um, trainers, but I do think that since you're Shinada, you need to do the most preparation in between each thing. There's definitely the most time in between each bout if you're doing it all at once. His Kiryu's you can blow through pretty much all in one go. Saijima's you just need to get the items. Uh, Akiyama's is rough, but at least you're doing the trainings themselves. Uh, and they, like, you can find a way around it. Shinada's training definitely demands the most skill with his kit. Uh, and is, I would, I would probably say, the most difficult trainer that doesn't engage in bullshit like Saiga does. What's that guy doing? What's that guy's plan? I, I, I've talked a bit about this game's second health bars, but I do like how it's like been like a boss exclusive thing for so long. But like you're, you can finally do it now. Because like having extra health bars, that was something only enemies could do. Uh, and I'm, I'm sort of bummed they never brought that back. Because I really liked it. I mean, I, I really like it. I still enjoy it. Uh, and I wish uh, that a future Yakuza game would bring that back. Because I, I like it. I really like it. It looks like the sturdy knife is going to be our best bet here. Just make sure you dodge to the right side. Because that sweep can catch you as you're dodging. Right, and his big sweep can hit you out of your block. So don't mess that up. He block him like he's gonna do the light. Just, I see the heavy attack coming just a second too late. For, for all his blustering, he is pretty good with his baton. And all his weapons, so just be ready. Oh yeah, your durability improvement, awesome. I guess that'd be good if I pick up any other bladed weapons. Ah, it's... Dodged a second too late. There. Both. Apparently, dropping the new Guilty Gear character today. I was gonna watch the stream, but I, mean, I had a show of my own to do. Arxis just knew I couldn't make it. They're probably announcing a character on a walk. It's just knowing my luck. I lucked out too hard with Johnny and Elfelt. You're gonna drop a fucking dud. Absolutely certain. We're gonna check the stream and it's gonna be ABA. I'm gonna be pissed. I don't want the ABA fans to win, they're annoying. Granted, Guilty Gear fans are annoying, but. You know. I mean, fans are annoying. But... I am the latter two. I sort of have to live with that. Oh god, the sack. That seems a little low, Shinada. Ouch! I learned to pull your punches during our lessons, you brute. What? You told me to do whatever I wanted. Ooh, is your cranium truly empty? What kind of vassal strikes his lord with all his strength? Wait, when did I go from student to vassal? Shinada. You must learn to show respect for those above your station. I don't know why I expect anything better of you, though. And you need to stop being such an ass face, Leo Kun. But fine. I apologize profusely for the accident of my birth. Happy? What? That is no apology. <clears throat> Never mind. I grow tired of this farce. At least I know what you are capable of. You're stronger than I thought. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks. Now then, Shinada, did you pick up on anything in particular about my fighting style? Your fighting style? Uh, 
are you doing? Why are you training? You gotta be bothered to pay attention. What if I told you about wasting my time? I am taking great care with each blow to ensure my weapons remain in pristine condition. There are ways to lower the stress upon your weapon no matter what technique you are using. Really? That's the first bit of magic-like wisdom I've heard from you so far. Insolent fool. Show some respect. Relax, will ya? It's just, I used to play pro baseball, so I can get that it's important to treat equipment properly. I'll try to keep that in mind. Ooh, Thrift Mastery. Now then, consider this payment for your services by master. You'll have to do something else for me if you want another lesson. Never expected to learn anything like that. This feudal service thing is totally worth it. Ah, the very model of a peasant. I see you do know your place after all. I look forward to what you come up with next. What we're gonna come up with next is not helping you. Because I'm gonna go do plot. But yeah, you see he's right here for training whenever we're ready for him in the future. Which, you know, we will be, but I don't want to right now. Right now, I'd like to make some story progress. Well, let's get this payphone. And be on our way. Jake should probably duck into a restaurant while we're here. One. There it is. Let's try this, 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 this. Oh. Oh, you're not a restaurant, you're a shop. Okay. I guess he likes it. Hey, Shinata. Oh, hi. Oh boy, you got that week before payday air about you. There's a stroke of good fortune for you. Here, take one of these. Oh, hey, the prize ticket. Yeah, we picked up one of those earlier. I think the Chamber of Commerce is doing. He gets up for shopping or dining locally. We find him all over town. Does he notice something that comes free? Let's give it a try. We got two tickets, so let's give it a spin. Right then, we get rid of that ticket for you. Go on and give it a speed. Yeah, oh. huh? eh, pocket tissues. <laughs> Great. The so green is bad. I don't remember what all the colors mean, but green is the lowest one. More pocket tissues. Sure. Yeah. Consolation prize for green. Great, two pocket tissues. Well, you never know when those will come in handy. Let's just find a restaurant and top our health up. And then we'll go help out, uh... Oh, hey, Kamiyama works. Let's actually duck in here. Even though Shinata has no reason to go in here. Hey. Let's craft some weapons. Uh, pearl, you know, lighter oil. Oh. Need to invest one sturdy pull. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, there's upgrades for um your sturdy weapons. That you have to donate your sturdy weapons to get, and I actually don't remember if they're good. The short sword, stun gun. Yeah. Best of sturdy katana for this one. Best of sturdy knife for this one. Best of sturdy iron pipe for this one. Best the dragon tail, invest the Maguro. Invest. Let's invest some of the dragon stuff we've got in our inventory. I don't think I still one of these. I think we must have one of these. Let's just do that. Uh, and let's see about what did that dragon tail just get us? Dragon Slayer. You have to go down the chain a little bit for that. 
Yeah, I I wouldn't I wouldn't give up your sturdy weapons. Not until you have a bunch of money, so you're probably not gonna want to do it until the finale. Because these sturdy weapons are really gonna be your workhorses for a lot of Shinada's story. Uh, and parting with them is a really bad idea. Uh, if there's one or two that you don't think you're gonna use a lot, then maybe, but I'd hold on to at least one sturdy weapon of Shinada. Uh, cause it just... You just given up what such a valuable asset, given his limited barehanded options. I your tackle is cool, but I find it situational at best. Uh, which is not something that a base character's toolkit should be. And also, yeah, now that we talked to that guy down west of the or down south of the park, we'll find his prize tickets on the ground. So we can take him there and try for prizes. Alright, long day, let's go home. We played a lot of baseball today. Even though nobody here has been there for that. I forgot to go to a restaurant, but that's fine. Uh, I don't think there's anything that happens after this. Or, I mean, we'll have an opportunity to eat once we're done with this. Or once we wake up. So, let's just wake up. And to do that, we'll have to go to sleep first. おい、高杉さん。今日も早いっすね。お前、随分好きした顔してんじゃねえかよ。風俗上に一発で似てもらったんかお前。まあ、似たところかな。あの男の依頼受ける覚悟がついたんだな。もう過去から逃げたりしない
じゃあそいつがお前に濡れ衣を着せたってことか飲んでまたさあね俺もなんでそんな嘘ついたのかその後輩を問い詰めたけど結局何も聞き出せなかったそのすぐ後そいつは行方不明になっちまったしね何だとまさか他の誰かに消されたってことなのかさあそれはどうだろうどちらにしろ俺一人では真相を探れそうにもなかったとにかく俺はその日からずっと自分の過去から目を背け風俗ライターとして生きてきたんだふうんお前さっき警察の捜査に乗り出したって言ったかサイン通ってそんなに重い罪なのかことが野球賭博に関係していると見られたからね一選手が打率を上げたいがためにやったことならまだしもでかい金が動く組織的な賭博容疑になっちまったし挙げくチーム全体にまで捜査の手は伸びることになったってことはひょっとしたらお前個人への恨みとかじゃなくワイバーンズを潰すために仕込まれた罠だったって可能性もあるってことかそうだとしたらそれは結果的に失敗だねあの事件で球界を追われたのはチームでも俺だけそれにあとは藤田監督が騒動の責任を取らされ辞任に追い込まれただけだ藤田かそういや昨日のニュース見たか東京で監督に復帰したみたいだな15年前にワイバーンズの監督を辞任してからずいぶん長かったなこの人はあの一件で俺以上に人生を狂わせちまった人なんだよあんなに俺によくしてくれたっていうのにお前が一軍にいたのが一日だけならそこまで世話になる関係もねえだろうそんなことない二軍で腐りかけていた俺を見つけてくれたのが藤田さんだったんだ二軍の指導法じゃ俺本来の良さが出ないって言ってじきじきに指導してくれてそのアドバイスがあって俺は一軍に上がれたようなもんなんだ恩師みたいなものだったってことかでもそうか考えたことなかったけど藤田監督を失脚させるために俺を利用したって可能性もあったのかだとしたら俺本当に自分が情けないよ恩をあだで返すってこういうことを言うんだねまあ本当の狙いが誰であれ事件の裏で必ず得した人間がいるはずだってなきゃ無名の選手をはめる理由なんてねえからなとりあえずだ当時のチームメイトとかに片っ端から聞いて回るっていうのはどうだ球団を辞めてからチームメイトとは一切連絡取ってないんださっきも言ったようにあの一件でチーム全体にも野球賭博疑惑がかかったりして今さら合わせる顔もないって感じなんだけどね唯一知ってるとしたら球団専属のマッサージ師だった人が金栄町にいるんだマッサージ師、うん、それってもしかしてお前が金を借りてるあいつのことかうん宇野さん今は小さな鍼灸院やってる風俗狂いなんだけどチームメイトからの信頼は厚い人だったその鍼灸院の場所はおびいた通りと紬通りの交差してるあたり早速行ってみます Let's go find Udo. First, we'll try his clinic. Should be a bit of a walk, but we'll be alright. Day out at least. But we'll be okay. Head on up. See what the guy wants. Or what we want from him. What exactly is the plan? Yeah, we're gonna talk to him about what happened. Put out, man. On a public road. Okay, in we go. 
ここか意外と小綺麗じゃないかいるかな宇野さんま入りますかうのさんいるルス閉じまりもしねえでのんきなやつだうのさんまたどっかの風俗行ってるなだったらここでマストしようすっきりしたら戻ってくんだろそれが今はうのさんすっきりできるお金ないんじゃないかな俺から3万回収しようとしてたくらいだからじゃあ何しに付属行ってんだよそんな時は決まって写真見学回り永遠にお店をはしごして写真を見てるよじゃあいつ帰ってくるかもわからねえじゃないかよ探しに行くしかないね<笑>機嫌に何店舗あると思ってんだよお前宇野さんは新人好きだから新しい子が入った店をしらみつぶしに探していけば会えるはずんいらっしゃいませ。Anything think somebody who's still kind of new. Very exciting. Boy chat from Resort Boing and Noriko chat from Bus. Jeez, fucking quality names. Hmm. Not different. You go for the younger one? Because that, but he's a pretty twisted guy and only goes still on the job of you kind of thing. I told me where these places are. South End, Smooth Street. Hmm. 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 Which one's closer? The one to the north. So let's go there. Beats the hell out of walking all that way. I suppose it is healthy to go outside, though. Here we are! Galbini likes to well, That would be a reasonable assumption. Ah, uh, excuse me. Welcome, party two? Oh no, we're just looking for someone. Did a balding middle aged guy come around asking for your new girl? He was here, alright. Which way you went? The info booth across the street? I think he headed in there. Huh. Dooms his hunt. This fucking guy. Look, he's a journalist. He's gotta keep up the news. Oh, perfect. I actually know this guy. Hey, what's up, man? Oh, hey, Shinata-san. What's new? How much? Listen, a middle-aged guy come through here? Kind of mopey, lacking in the hair department. Most likely asking for amateurs. Oh, yeah, I do remember someone like that. Why? What's going on? Nothing, we just need to talk. Any idea where he went? I did tell him about two of the newest recruits, so he might have gone to see at least one of them. Tell me about them. There's Kudayatan. Industry vet, so not really an amateur. Changed. Inspiring. Katan. Not that attractive. Oh, that's your buddy, too. Strategy's actually more mature than she looks on. She has nothing going for her. Jesus, Shinada. I'm hmm. fine as I do love her. We give a damn about it. This guy thinks this one's on you, buddy. Where would these places be located? It's Icho Street. And right across the street of Tsumugi Street. 
Uh, I guess we should get going. Just doing my job, friend. Alright. Let's see. Ah! Pfft. See, now I'm thinking that it's gonna be the one that's forever away. Right? Like, that would make sense. Okay. Okay. Could be just around this. Hey, oh, yep, there he is. Getting kicked out. <laughs> I think. Getting kicked out. Yes, he is. なんでだよ。日焼け大観芸と読むとに書いてるだろ。おお、見つけた。死ぬだ。返せ。すぐ俺の3万返せ。本物の新人発見したんだ。しかも業界未経験平成生まれ。働きなよ、宇野さん。新
いるいる単純なやつだ<笑>いらっしゃいでお前かお金ならちゃんと払うよあの闇金屋の金だろうその闇金屋ならここに。宇野さんの客としてなら。問題ないでしょ<笑>横になれ。十五年ぶりだな。お前の体を見るのは。俺も生還以外のマッサージを受けるのは現役の時以来だよ。宇野さん以外に筋肉触られたくなかったしね。トレーナー妙利に尽きる言葉だ。宇野さん。どうして球団専属やめちゃったの。宇野さんほど腕のいいトレーナーはそうはいない。球団も必死に引き止めたでしょうに。チームに帯同して日本中の風俗巡りできるのは良かったんだがな。朝が早かっただろう。だから早朝割引が使えなかったのが悔しくてな。まあ、そういう面じゃ今の方がありがてえよ。まったこんな時まで冗談言わないの<笑>クビになったんだよ俺も15年前お前が追放されたのとほとんど同時期だ俺の他にいい球団専属トレーナーが見つかったからって突然電話で解雇を言い渡されたんだ開幕前に契約延長して少なくともそのシーズンは専属が決まってたってのにその直後いきなりクビだなんて言われたんだ知らなかったお互い過去の話はしなかったからなそれなりに鼻のあった野球界から突然掘り出されて何が何だかわからないまま気づけば15年こんな生活もお互い板についたもんだよなで聞きたかった話ってこんなことかいや、宇野さんさ、例えばの話なんだけど、俺が球界を追放になって、誰か得した人っていると思うどうしたお前からそんな話振ってくるなんて珍しいな。得をした人間いるわけねえだろ。監督、選手、ファン、誰もいいことなんてあれしなかった。おまけに、ヤクザまで損したもんだ。ヤクザ覚えてねえかお前の八百長容疑がきっかけになって野球賭博が一斉摘発されたのああそういや当時この辺りで賭博の利権を持ってた二つの国もよ摘発のせいでしのぎ削れなくなって名古屋から撤退したって話だ二つの国ああ東と西のでっかい組だよ東上会と近江連合だっけ昨日牛島さんの店でその組の人たち見たよお前あん時のプロ野球選手だってバレたらぶっ殺されてもおかしくないぜ大丈夫だよ金営で俺の過去を知ってるのは宇野さんだけだしなんであんなことが起きちまったんだろうなみんなただ野球をやってただけなのに何が野球とばくだよ結局、宇野さんに聞いても手がかりなしか。よし、調整完了。ああ、久しぶり。体軽くなった。当たり前だろ。俺を誰だと思ってんだよ。悪いね、宇野さん。変なことばっか聞いちゃって。まあ。おかげで風俗代稼げたぜじゃあありがとう、うんおい品田携帯忘れちまってんぞなっ宇野さん思い出したまさかあの時の携帯のせいなのか携帯がどうかしたんですかほらさっき話したろ15年前俺が突然クビになった時のことだ
実はあの時も今みたいに選手がマッサージルームに忘れていった携帯を届けたことがあったんだはあ誰の携帯あれはそう確か真鍋だ真鍋の携帯だったああ真鍋さん真鍋っつったら当時ワイバーンズの4番を打てたあの真鍋かそうだあの時真鍋は携帯をなくして大騒ぎしていたんだこれ誰の携帯だその日マッサージルームに忘れてあった携帯を見つけた俺は急いでロッカールームに持って行ったそしたらおいどこだ俺の携帯がなくなっとるぞ誰か知らんかおいああのー、真鍋さんこれチャーゲーなんでてめえが持ってるんだああ真鍋は俺から携帯を取り上げると必死になって何かをチェックしたちょちょっと真鍋さんありがとうの一言ぐらい言ってくれても。真鍋さんそれよりおめえ携帯の中見てねえだろうなあの時の真鍋の目あれは普通のもんじゃなかった携帯の中には何があったんださああの頃は俺もまだ自分の携帯なんて持ってなかったから使い方がよく分からず何も見やしなかっただが今思えばあの時の真鍋の態度はちょっと変だったひょっとしてその携帯野球賭博に関係していたとかメールで指示が来ていたとかありえるなあんたは野球賭博に関するメールを見たと疑われそれで球団をクビになったそうかそういうことだったのか真鍋さんを調べてみる必要がありそうだね今何してるかわかる確か5年ぐらい前に引退したよなああその後いろいろ事業を起こしたんだがことごとく全部失敗して今は狩り場町で小さな焼肉屋をやってる焼肉屋か一度食いに行ってやったら追い返されたそう思うとますます怪しく感じてきたな焼肉屋俺も行ってみるよありがとう Ah. Well, that was a lot. Things I see in Manabi san's place. Yakiniku. Jesus Christ, this is what you called. Yakiniku ito kai. Kai. Fucking hell. Uh, that should not have been as difficult as it was. Ah, uh, we'll go for this one because there's also a safe spot. Hey. Eventually, I'll figure out where the hell I'm going. I guess I won't be that bad if it is ABA. I just don't like. I I don't have a problem with ABA. I just don't like her fans. She hasn't been in the game since 2X, so maybe they'll do something interesting with her. They could also do something interesting with Venom or Jam. Okay, or Dizzy. I don't know. I just feel like we have we have Gold Lewis, who does her whole shtick but better. Her big thing swung around. I save. Save. I think I did. You can never be too sure. Uh, what I should do is eat. Uh, restaurant right here. I know we're headed to a restaurant, but I don't think. Huh. Hold on. What the fuck? Huh. Who 
who's who's doing this? Shut up. Yeah, pretty much. I agree. Oh, I'm I don't know about we. That was a plan. That was just one potted plan. That was more directed at me. I don't know if you should have been too worried about yourself that time. Hello. Need to drink and food. I'm about to go to a restaurant and I'm worried it's gonna end in a fight. Just do do dum. And choice kurobuta. Kurobuta. Just do do dum and miso stupid dum with choice kurobuta. Two spirit buffs. Very nice. If I recall correctly, that is a buff to our heat gain. Uh, let me double check. Those. Venture. Subst. Uh, eating, drinking. Oh. Age. Oh no, boost heat power. Okay. Okay. Focus keeps our heat above a certain threshold and strength increases our damage. Strength is probably the one we want to gun for the most often. Shinada actually uses a lot of heat moves, so that actually won't hurt. Um, he gets a lot of freebie heat moves just from constantly having weapons on hand. Let's go to the restaurant! Here we go. What's going on in here? Hi. Your door was unlocked. Manabasa. Dare datta ga na. Katte ni chori ba ni herare ると困るんだがね。覚えてませんか<笑>そうっすよねたった一日一軍にいただけの選手のことなんて覚えてませんよね本当。死なだけ思い出してもらえて光栄ですみなりが変わってまって気ぃつかんかっただけだわあんたのことは忘れたくても忘れられんがね<笑>そりゃどういう意味の忘れられないだバッターとしての品田が忘れられないっていう意味じゃねえよなうんあんたは品田の連れだ気にしないでくれ真鍋さん仕事中申し訳ないんですがちょっと聞きたいことがあって何の用だできることならあんたの面なんて見たねえわおいおい15年ぶりに訪ねてきた後輩に対してあんまりじゃねえのか<笑>それともこいつに嗅ぎ回られたくないことでもあるのか例えば野球賭博のこととかこれ<笑>以上その言葉を口にするな。死にたなかったらなあからさまな脅しだなこれじゃ疑ってくださいって言ってるようなもんじゃねえかうのに聞いてきたんかえ,え聞きてあこと言うのは15年目のことかはいでももちろん俺は野球賭博があったなんて思ってない実際俺はサイン等なんてしてなかったわけですからこんなら何が聞きたい確認しておきたいんです。当時、ワイバーンズの中心選手だったあなたの口から、野球賭博はなかったと聞きたい。それだけです。話したるわ。だでこれ以上その件について探ろうとするな。いいか。野球賭博は。誰からの指示かわからんだが勝敗を操作するために
サイン党やヤオチョウの指示がケーテアに入ってきとったのは確かだわその指示に逆らった選手はなぜか数ヶ月以内に球団を去ってっただで俺たちは野球選手であり続けるためにその指示に従い続けたということだわそんなでもずっと球団にいたけど俺はそんな事実一度もあんたは一軍にたった一日おっただけだ不正行為の指示を受け取ったのは一軍のレギュラー陣だでなはっ<笑>こんなにもあっさり認めるとは驚きたいな肉も野球も同じなんだわ逆に出される肉はよこういった食べれいせん筋を裏方が必死になって取ってまって手間暇かけてきれいになった一部分を表に出すんだ<笑>野球にだって表には出せへん部分があるってことだわ出す必要もねえ観客の誰もそれを見ることを望んどらへんわだでよ知らんで済むことなら知らんでおった方が楽なんだよ海は肉食うのに悲鳴上げて殺されていく牛の姿なんて想像したねえだろう知らんでええんだよ裏で何があったかなんて知らん方がいい俺にとって野球は全てだったここまで知ってしまってはいそうですかなんて言えると思いますか真鍋さんあんたはもう野球界離れてる当時の野球賭博のことを公にしても時効で罪に問われないはずだその黒幕は誰だったのか突き止めようと思わなかったのか思わんこともなかったが危険を犯してまで突き止めようとは思わんかったわ危険実際ワイバーンズから他球団にトレードされた選手の一人がそのことを暴露しようとしたんだ八百長に耐えきれんかったんだろうだがなそいつは不良の事故で死んでまった事故だで俺以上探るのはやめろよう分かっただろう俺もあんたもマジで命が危なくなるぞもはや危険な目にやっとるんじゃないかもう身に覚えぐらいあるだろうそういえばまさかさっきのもうかあれキャーっていつもの生活に戻れええ最後に一つ聞かせてくださいなんで15年間隠し通していたことを教えてくれたんですか危険だということは承知していたはずなのにどうして結果的にお前が追放されたことをきっかけに野球賭博がなくなったのも事実だだでおめえには知る権利があるそう思っただけだ俺が追放されて野球賭博が終わった何なんだよそれさっきの質問がセアゴだと言ったろあとは自分で考えろそしたらわかるはずだこれ以上首を突っ込むことがどんだけどえりゃことなのかちょ今日やっとらんのおお今開けるとこだでええー、どうぞおぼえあつわいしょどっちのさ I see no way this goes poorly. We're in like, what? 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We're in like chapter 14 of a Yakuza game. It's not like anything starts getting darker and tense by then. Look, we're fighting this guy. He's making funny, funny gestures. He's got a hat on. I'm gonna punch him. I've time. 
Nothing he can do. He's helpless against the sword. Yeah. Damn. That boot does so much more damage. Alright, well, with that addressed, now let's go talk to Uno.野球賭博は行われていたのか。一体誰が仕組んだんだ。うちの長男でもわかるぜ。野球賭博を仕切ってたヤクザ。ほほう。ついに息子に追いついたか。小六だけどよ。うんだけど、結果的にそのヤクザ
とにかくこれではっきりしたんだもし名古屋組の組長ってやつから話を聞き出せれば2000万円の依頼は完了高杉さんに借金は返せるし俺は自分を利用した人間を知れるだからその名古屋組ってのもそこの組長ってのも実在するかどうかもわからないんだぞでもそれ以外道はないでもどうやって探すんだよん匂わないかガス漏れてんぞ窓開ける窓誰だ A mysterious figure! We have to chase him! Perhaps he is the one who contains our answers. We'll beat them out of him. Chase the mysterious stranger! He was not trying very hard. He was definitely leaky gas in through a glass door. I don't know what the plan was to get away with this. Bottle! Fuck you! 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 We're almost there. Oh god. No. Stop it. I didn't need to do that. I'm on my second health bar. I can't I can't restore that. Come back! Come back, you freaking dingus! Hey, dumbass! Come here! これひでえ事故だな事故じゃないえあそこの屋上に人影が見えた屋上って何も見えねえぞどんな視力してんだお前視力は 2.0 胴体視力にも自信があるけどまさかどんなやつだったんだよなんでこんなところに知った顔だったのか誰なんだよワイバーンズでチームメイトだった酒井さん酒井どうしてお前が酒井さんあんたが殺したのか答えろよ酒井<笑>ここじゃ瞳につくでよみんなが入る目酒井さん説明してくれどういうことなんだ元気にやっとらせるな品だ宇野さんも勝手だいうことは分かっとるけど品だみんなをよう俺をよう許してちょそんなもん持って許してほしいってどういうつもりですか品だスラッガーにとって一番美しいプレイヤー何か知っとるか犠牲フライだがやチームのために犠牲になる自分が塁に出ることは絶対ねえが誰よりもチームに貢献しとる品だ
おめえのことは絶対忘れません許したってちょう後悔してももう遅いでよバスター通信サッカー He's got a big pipe. He's got a lot of health. But we have a knife. Your sturdy knife is probably going to be your biggest workhorse for most of Shinada's story. It's fast. Probably the best way to press any、uh, openings you get through dodging or blocking. Just make sure to pick up Regard as quick as you can. Because some of your enemies do have some pretty hefty swings. And of course, there's no shame in healing.、Uh, do keep an eye out for that wheel kick. You've seen it a few times now, it can stun you. That could be nasty. <laughs> This guy's fucking cheering! Dude! A l l help, baby! Maybe something more than emotional support? I don't know, don't Yakuza usually carry. Oh, wait, no, you're not a Yakuza. Wouldn't you load sharks usually carry a weapon on you? I don't know. There's probably a few, like, heavy pipes or something around here you can grab. t o do something. There's a, there's a pretty consistent pattern here. Block his attacks, get your three stabs in. Um. Wait until you build heat. Hit him while he's down. And then pull your heat action for some more big damage. Still don't like how they spin while they're standing up. Just so they can block. But, you know, whatever. It's been in every game. I'm not about to start. Giving five shit has been happening since three. And arguably probably happened in one and two. I wouldn't know. Snap, snap, snap! And snaps. Ow! I said snap, snap, snap! Get up! Get up! It's sword time! Ow! Okay, never mind, it's heal time. Uh, let's pop the s t e p e r o n Very nice. Wow. One, and two, and three. That went right through the bottom of his ribs. That is. That is evisceration, bare minimum. Uh, do I have any other heat actions I can. Sword? Ooh. Uh, abilities. Heat actions. Du -du -du. Finish stomp, finishing crit. Or finish. Bucket holding sign. One handed weapon. Two handed weapon. w e r holding sword. Salt shaker, golf club, stove, flyers, bike, super glue, skyrocket. And drawing weapon. Ooh. I know that one. Nope. <laughs> Never mind. I hit him with the putting away. Sakai san. Tanomu got a Hanash to Hoshi. どうしてこんな真似をたまたまあの時よおめえが一軍に昇格してきたことでよ一軍の中でおめえだけが事情を知らせんちゅう都合のいい状況が生まれてまってよ俺はな品だおめえには悪いことしたと思っとるがおめえを犠牲にしてまったことを全然後悔しとらせん犠牲おうおめえは名古屋のために犠牲になってまったんだわ名古屋の犠牲って何なんだよどういう意味なんだよはっきり言ってくれ酒井さんそりゃあおダメだ死んでる
俺が名古屋の犠牲になったってどういうことなんだ、well. That was heavy. Whatever, I thought it was funny. Anyway, chapter three. Price of truth. The price is having a bunch of shit dropped on you. Various pieces of construction equipment. Flashback. Hontoni in this car. Motira. Bora, okay, son of one this car. Mata, Stamo, Satamo, Utava, Ida, and Hanashis. Homer and Bora, Iko, and Nico, don't take on us. Demo. Ha, I don't this day. ここだけの話なんですけど俺自分で打った弾とかをお客さんから譲ってもらって保存するようなやつ好きじゃないんすよなんかちっちゃいって思いません<笑>ほらあなたは俺のファン一号そのボールが高い値で売れるよう俺もこれから頑張りますから一応これも証拠品に回しとけ品田達夫さんですねチートお伺いしたいことがありますのでこちらへあえっええー、加減吐いたらどうなんだだからやってないもんはやってないんですってっていうかいい加減返してもらえませんか明日から広島との A クラスをかけた試合もあるんでじゃあこいつを見てもまだそんなこと言っとれるんかなしっとる男なんだな地元の後輩ですこの写真の男がギガンツのキャッチャーのサインを盗むようあんたに頼まれたと証言したそうだ映ってる男は確かに後輩だよでも金を渡してるのは俺じゃねえつうかこんなのバカげてる大体この写真に映ってるのだって俺だって証拠はないじゃんかこんないたずらを真に受けてる警察も警察だ何やってんだよもうたくさんだこんなとこ監禁されてたら体がなまっちまう帰らせてくれおめえは名古屋ワイバーンズの勝利に200万かけとったらしいがねえこの写真の男がなおめえが野球賭博に関与しとったとも証言しとるんだ何言ってんだあんた野球賭博で儲けたくて金払ってサイン盗ませとったんだろうそんなわけないでしょう。だいたい球種が分かってたからって簡単にホームランなんて打てねえ。少し考えればわかることだろう。そう興奮するなしなだ。お宮の場合、もはや社会的制裁を受け取るで。素直に認めれば、起訴猶予ということも十分あり得るんだ。社会的制裁？俺が？何の話だ？聞いとるせんのか。おめえは野球協会から永久追放処分を受けたんだわ永久追放みーちゃんどう紹介した仕事はちゃんとお風呂で稼げばさ借金返済身も心もきれいになって出直せるってもんよん顎が痛いそんなの当たり前だろうが借金まみれの女が泣き言言ってんじゃねえよ大体いいそんなこと言ってっからお前なあっぼ終わりうい、えー、こっちの話だよいいから文句言わないで働けよじゃあお
どうした今日仕事ってわけでもねえのにパソコンなんか使って何見てんだこの15年間の沢田の投球データだよデータなんだよこれプロのスコアラーが作ったみたいなやつじゃないかまそこらのスコアラーのデータよりはマシだと思うけどねどうしたんだよこれ Y バンドのやつからもらったのかいやまさかお前ずっと自分で配給データ作ってたわけじゃねえよなやめられないんだよねあれだけ野球を忘れたいって思ってんのにさお前これ沢田のやつだけじゃねえじゃねえか12球団全一軍投手のデータだよコース吸収スピード逆球かどうか全部入ってるなんでこんなもん高杉さん前に球種が分かっていてもホームランなんて打てないって話したじゃない実はあれ半分本当で半分嘘なんだんプロの世界じゃ来た球を打ち返すってだけじゃ一流のバッターにはなれない相手の配球を8割方分かった上でその球を打ち返すそのうちどのくらいの確率で前に打球を飛ばせるかが一流と二流を分ける差となるじゃあお前はあのホームラン狙って打ったっていうのかあああの時俺は知ってた6球連続カーブの後ツーナッシングから沢田がストレートを投げてくるってねで今さらこのもん見て何しようってんだ配給データの奥に名古屋組の正体が見えるとでも言うつもりかいや真鍋さんや酒井さんの言ってたことが本当かどうか確かめてたんだなんだそれ真鍋さんは俺が球界を追放されたあの事件の後から八百長が亡くなったと言っていた確かにデータを見る限りワイバーンズは15年前のあの試合を境に素人目にはわからないレベルだがおかしな配球やおかしなベンチワークがきれいさっぱりなくなってるそんなのデータだけでわかるのか野球ってのは驚くくらい定石の塊のスポーツだからねなるほどなそれだけじゃない15年前の試合を境にワイバーンズはチーム編成も一変しているそれまでの地元出身の選手を優先的に取る法人から外国人選手の獲得トレードも積極的に行ってるそれじゃ酒井ってやつが言ってた話と逆じゃねえか確かあいつはお前のことを名古屋を守るための犠牲者だと言ってたがあれって名古屋出身の選手を守るって意味じゃなかったってのかそうなんだよ酒井さんの言っていた名古屋ってのはチームのことを言っていたわけじゃないもっと大きな例えばそうこの町全体に関わるような話なのかもしれない町金栄町か俺も高杉さんもこの町の裏側を知っているようでいてその実情は知らないもしかしたら名古屋組を探るにはこれ以上球団関係者ばかり追いかけていても意味がないのかもしれないな15年前あの事件がきっかけでこの町に何か変化が起きたのかそれを探る必要があるってことかあ,あ誰かその辺の事情に明るい人間はいないのかそれならもってこいの人がいるよこの町の顔役的な人がね顔役商店街会長をしてるダイニングバー牛島の店長牛島さんだ俺がこの辺に流れ着いた時からよくしてくれてる人でね牛島さんならこの界隈の裏事情にも精通してるさてと
じゃあ牛島さんの店に行ってみますかマシな情報がつかめりゃいいがな牛島さんの店に行ってみますかじゃあ牛島さんの店に行ってみますかJust that easy. Alright, Devon is easy. Into the restaurant. ね。付け代払いに来たのか。いや、今日は聞きたいことがあって来たんです。付け代払うまで出入り禁止って言っただろう。付け代は俺が払おう。ああ、あんたか。品田に金貸し取るあんまり評判のような小売り貸しさんっ
本日町通りを境目に登場会大見連合が島争いしとってな裏じゃその飛ばちを受けて揉め事や抗争が後を絶たず治安も相当悪かった今はこんな平和なのに当時野球賭博の利権を握っとったのが登場会と大見連合でよまあ賭博の利権に限らず東と西の勢力図のちょうど真ん中にあたるこの辺で勢力がぶつかり合う形になっとったんだほんでもある事件がきっかけとなって二つの組は名古屋から出てってまった15年前のワイバーンズ野球賭博の一件だ覚えてらんかあああああれかま俺はろくにスポーツも見いせんから事件の内容はよう知らんけどその事件で野球賭博への警察の監視が強まりそれぞれの胴元をやっとった登場会と近江連合が名古屋から撤退することになった登場会と近江連合と入れ替わりでこの辺を取り仕切るようになったのはその名古屋組だわこの辺が名古屋組の島になってから15年極道には変わらんだろうがそれ以来構想も見かじめもなくなって不名誉な事件が起こった事実と引き換えにみんなそれなりに満足した毎日を過ごしとるんだ名古屋のための犠牲点と点が結ばれてきたなあんた名古屋組のボスって男に心当たりはないのかあんたら何のためにそんなことを調べとるか知らんけどいい加減にしとけボスが誰かなんて知らん誰だろうと興味ねえわこの町の裏側を名古屋組が守ってくれてるこの町で商売する人間にとったらそれだけで十分なんだわフォンカーわからんけど男の一人はほっぺたに傷があった今後を追って名古屋港の62番倉庫近くまで来とるんだけどミルクちゃん高崎さん俺ちょっと行ってくるタグよお前が行くっつんだったら俺も行くしかねえじゃねえか高杉さん<笑>じゃあ牛島さんまた何かあったら聞かせてああそうそうこのコーヒーはつけじゃなくていいよね<笑>ああガルカジカンドバイハウス62ダークサイドモデルシャーズバトルゲームサブチューでしたデスデスキッドデスガイはいあーファーストスウェイズデスウェイあーガッフォンカーマリオマルノさん I have to do a thing here あーウロさんそれは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。それは大変だ。I am ready to order.、Uh, I'll have a. Oh, I have a cake set. Oh, and a sandwich. 
Let's get the sandwich set and let's get a get this bolognese ankake spaghetti with hatsho miso. You can always tell which ones are the um, the tatsuya dishes because they've got like seven more syllables than anything else on the menu. Awesome. All right. Now that we're fully, now that our belly is full of delicious food, now we'll go save Uno-san. We got a strength buff, we got a focus buff. Those are the ones I want. All right. Let's go! Definitely stay away from the sidewalk so people don't throw more stuff at us. That was uncool. Okay. Who knows on? We're here to rescue you! Uruk Arg! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, he's dead. Oh no, he's not. He's twitching. しっかりしてうのさん。俺が救急車呼ぶ。しなさん。お前は早く仲間のところへ行け。高杉さん。後で俺も行くから、それまで死ぬんじゃねえぞ。All right, cab to warehouse of 62. There's no time to lose. All right, except. Uh, we're going to call it right there. What? She'll be fine. I have a cold. Leave me alone. Head hurts. This is I, that's why I did a lot of story today, is because uh, my voice is shot and I... Sucks. So I did not want to be... Contending with a lot of explaining shit. So, you know, you let the cutscenes do the talking for a while. Um... But, uh, yeah. I, I am aware that I did start late, so it is actually a little late for me. But, uh... I mean, I had fun. I like, I like this. We're, we're, we're hitting, the story's starting to hit its stride, so we're definitely, we're in, we're back in the plot now. So, uh, yeah. There's not really much else to say. Uh, Saturday, we'll be back with Mother 3. Next week, Wednesday, same time. Probably an hour before, hopefully, at least. We will be back with Yakuza 5 Remastered Legend Difficulty. So, yeah, chat, thanks for coming out. VOD watchers, hello, hello. And until I see you all again, I'm Ajay Tetsuka Rose, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. <laughs>